Hello, everyone. I'm Ankur Shah, Senior Vice President of Products for Prisma Cloud at Palo Alto Networks. Over the last 10 years, I've been fortunate to be in a position to help organizations secure their journey to the cloud. I'm here to talk about the cloud security landscape and how Prisma Cloud can help organization embrace public cloud while ensuring that their infrastructure and applications are secure. In the last decade, IT has gone through a major transformation unlike anything we've seen before. This transformation was led by developers who are leveraging public cloud to build cloud native applications. Organizations are building and shipping applications faster than before. Disney Plus, for example, got to 100 million plus subscribers in three years, what took Netflix a decade, thanks to public cloud. By 2023, 70% of all enterprise workload will be deployed in public cloud, up from 40% in 2020. In two years, most of the enterprises are expected to build more than half of their applications using cloud-native, microservices-based architectures and technologies. Let me tell you a little bit about how these applications are built and deployed. In the code and build phase, developers are increasingly leveraging open source components. 75% of the code base now contains these open source components. The code is then packaged up into an image in the deploy phase and sits in the registries where it goes through further validations. In the last and the final run phase, the image gets deployed in public cloud infrastructure, using infrastructure as code, using infrastructure components like compute, identities, network, and data stores. The entire process of code, build, deploy, run happens rather quickly. Organizations are able to go from the code to cloud phase in a matter of minutes. While the developers are moving fast and building and shipping applications faster than before, security teams are still trying to figure out how to secure the cloud infrastructure and apps. There are security challenges left at every stage of the pipeline. Supply chain risk, secrets exposure, IP theft, crypto mining, data exfiltration, and the list goes on. Over 18,000 customers were impacted by SolarWinds supply chain attack not too long ago. 100 million plus endpoints were impacted by the Log4j vulnerabilities, and enterprises are still dealing with literally thousands of incidents on a daily basis due to this critical incidence. The standard industry response to rein all of this in is to build point solutions with a whole bunch of three and four letter acronyms, SCA, ISC, SAS, DAST, CWP, CSPM, KIM, WAS, CNS, SBOM, and the list goes on. The problem gets even worse when you add multiple clouds. The average customer is using over 10 tools just to secure their application and cloud estate. What the industry needs is not another four-letter acronym, but a platform that can secure the applications from code to cloud. This is why we built Prisma Cloud, the only code to cloud native application protection platform, otherwise known as CNAP. We secure the application lifecycle at every stage of the pipeline, the code, build, deploy, and run. Four years ago, we set out the vision to deliver a platform that delivers an integrated solution in your runtime, spanning cloud workloads, networks, identities, posture management, data, and so forth. Having executed on this vision, we're now setting a more ambitious goal to secure organization journey from code to cloud, spanning AppSec and cloud security. Towards that vision, we launched IAC Secure Infrastructure as Code Security capability earlier in the year, which has been well received by the customers. Today, I'm pleased to announce the general availability of Software Composition Analysis, SCA, to scan open source component for vulnerabilities. With this launch, Prisma Cloud will be the only vendor that can trace an open source vulnerability from code build phase all the way to the runtime. The world does not need one more vulnerability. What the world really needs is something that can trace it from code to cloud. Additionally, we're launching following capabilities for runtime. We're going to be able to detect internet exposure for all your Azure environment to add all the capabilities we already had for AWS. We're going to be doing DLP and malware scanning for Azure blob stores. To integrate all of these capabilities across different threat vectors, we're launching Unified Cloud Inventory that gives you a centralized visibility across identity, a workload protection, and, and, and so forth. We're also adding granular rule-based access control. We have multiple constituents as part of our uh, user base, the DevOps teams, the centralized security teams, compliance, and this granular RBAC capability will allow different user personas 
to use the product effectively. We plan to add more capabilities across the entire application lifecycle from code to cloud to ensure that customers don't have to use point solutions to secure their cloud journey. As we build this comprehensive code to cloud scene app, here are the five principles that will stand behind. Number one, it's code to cloud. You can't look at security in silo and use a whole bunch of point solutions. You gotta take a platform approach, which is what we're taking. Number two, real-time visibility. Your cloud workloads are moving fast and so are the attackers. You cannot afford to have visibility that is delayed by 12 to 24 hours. What you need is real-time visibility that alerts you as and when incidents take place. Okay, number three, prevention first. Effective cloud security should put prevention first. Visibility detection and alerting are not useful without aggressive automatic prevention capability. Number four principle is choice. Your developers are bringing their own cloud providers, AWS, Azure, GCP, AliCloud, Oracle, and the list goes on. They're gonna bring their favorite source code management tool, their favorite CI CD tool. With Prisma Cloud, we're gonna give you the choice. You don't have to pick and choose winners. You'll have all the tools in the tool bag to enable and empower your developers to embed security as part of their pipeline. And the final principle is scale. Uh, as your workloads and cloud footprints grow and scale, we will make sure that your security scales along with it. As I wrap up, I'd like you to remember three simple things. There's really no stopping the rapid transition to the cloud. Developers are moving fast and shipping applications faster than before. If you're a security practitioner, your goal is to enable developers to move fast while securing the infrastructure and application. Number two, you need a platform, not point products, approach to solving this problem. And last, trusted by around 2,000 active customers, we're the largest and the only code to cloud scene app in the industry. We would love to be your security partner of choice in the journey to the cloud. Thank you.